So this is the setting where uh, Mopa is coming up. This is the backyard of Mopa Airport in Goa, the new airport in Goa. Almost like 16th century and uh, hopefully the 21st, 22nd side by side who gets affected, who benefits million dollar question old village, old village in the background yeah, I, I've got it, it's on, it's on yeah, yeah and uh, a very old village in the background I think so. With modernity, there's a car there. There's a car there. There's a car there. Yeah. And there's a baker. There's, there's not a baker. He's a guy selling fish, probably because he's got he's got a horn, but it's a plastic. Dish. So you know, Dinesh, I was just saying a little you while. Don't say anything. Just request. You just catch my uh, my door. Sorry. And then say sorry and get off with it. Fine also. I was just saying that uh, 16th century, 17th century, 18th century side by side with the 21st, 22nd. Who told you this 16th century? Why they are in 16th century? They have a car there. Are they not 21st century? Yeah. But their way of living is different. No? Has been destroyed. Uh, you work, uh, if, if you don't mind us talking on this. No, no, I mind. Fine. Don't okay. So, but you know, yes. anyway, I'll say to myself that uh, you know, I at times like this, I think of Mathani and uh, his vision for Goa, which uh, his his vision was for Goa was Dabuli is an international airport and therefore Dabuli should be allowed, it should be expanded. Correct. And, and he also felt that Dabuli should be in the state hands, not in the navy hands. Correct. So how does? No, nothing here. Nothing here. Small shop. How does that tie up with uh, with this full Mopa debate? Because Mopa takes it on a new line altogether. Not we are not together. asking. Now Mopa is uh, double is dead. They are saying they will keep it uh, side by side oh, and all the, that. The politicians who want votes from the south will always state that they will keep it. Yeah, but we but to fool the people. Yeah, but inside inside they may actually want to kill it. They, whether because they'll want, uh, they want or not, it will be killed. It'll happen. <laughs> yeah, because how do you keep two airports alive? It doesn't make sense. For no airport hospital. will keep staff at both airports. They yeah. have to make a choice. Already, it's not airport. not a choice. I think some some uh, flights have been allocated here because no, there's uh, no question of you have a choice because the fees over there. See, and this is another great uh, this thing. The government initially will uh, they will levy very low landing charges. Okay consumer charges okay. and all that stuff and all that stuff and lure you here and lure you here and then they will do like uh, Ahmedabad where the customer was paying 100 rupees has to now pay 700 rupees I see so it's only a matter of time when the people will know the actual fees and other costs which uh, GMR will recover from them they should not yeah. go by the initial rates fixed yeah it's all all that when right. it is public when it was with the any uh, this Airport National Authority, Authority yeah. and uh, uh, National uh, Airport Authority of India. Uh, uh, NA, yeah. yeah, that time everything was uh, was this. Okay, the facilities may not have been that great, yeah. but they were very oh, good enough. Yeah. And now they have improved the facilities just a bit, but raised the uh, uh, charges ten fees, times. User fees. User fees ten times. In that, terms yeah. of see that wow, see that, see that. What? See, you you are blind. See that going up into the hill. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> Tell me something. What is the story of three roads? So they are three opposed roads. Yeah. That is a opposed road now apparently. Isn't it? You took a clear picture of that? Yeah. As clear as the camera could get because we are at some distance. But as we go closer, you will uh, you will see more. So this is some kind of a, what? Flyover? Yeah. 
It's an elevated road. It's not a flyover. It's an elevated road. I huh. told you, yeah. from Dargal yeah. to here. Yeah. So you you once the vehicle starts at Mopa, it will go up to Dargal okay. and Ind. Ind. Okay. No, no animal or person or or. A few years back, it would be have been inconceivable to think of uh, concretization at this scale, no? At this speed. At this speed. At this scale. I remember Mandovi Bridge took them years to build, no, just to complete a bridge in those days because they were using technology of those times, which was also probably more people friendly and. Uh, Not a pressure of people. There was no equipment like that. Yeah. Had no foreign exchange. Yeah. Nothing. Nothing. Yeah. Nothing. Yeah. That yeah, was the seventy. Thank, 70s. Uh, was the thank Manmohan Singh of 1991 for opening up the economy and permitting the. import of all these equipment so is it a good thing or a bad thing or a mixed blessing according to you from a environmental point of view and from a economic point of view how would you see it i don't know it's hard to say i still ecologically it's a disaster hmm. because see when the government project comes it it, it provides compensation to the land loser yeah but what happens to those the those who are living on this land like the uh, landless agriculture means uh, landless who may not figure on the uh, you ownership no he gets nothing uh, then uh, the uh, uh, fields which are and and uh, orchards which are which, which are adjoining this thing hmm. but have been destroyed by ever of course there's also the other and point that life therefore, li- therefore, livelihood therefore therefore the yeah. new they should have received all these people who are not directly affected but chai boss ya mare koi tori but they should have been compensated and uh, and that act of fair a fair compensation yeah which provides for a social audit to be conducted huh. was bypassed i see so that the cost of cost is totally reduced okay uh, and who gains only the private party gains right. at the cost of the people of goa maybe we should stop for a cup of tea but where there should be some tea available yeah where do you stop in the middle of the road <laughs> so that's that's my friend for you here no you can't just go <laughs> into anyone's house there there is one there's a